This video tutorial will demonstrate how to create a listing on the storefront platform for your showroom, retail or event space. This is a very simple three step process that will take less than five minutes to set up. Firstly, you want to go to the icon on the top right hand side and select list your space. Now you want to enter the address of the space. Here you want to in indicate which type of space you are listing. For example, you can list an art space, you can an uh, art gallery space, you can list an event space, you can list a lobby space. For this example, we want to list we will list a shop slash boutique space. Here we need to enter the size of the space. Here you want to indicate what the renters will have access to, whether it's the entirety of the space, part of the space, so this could be half the space or a, a shelf space or entirety or part of the space. For this example, we will select in the entirety of the space. Here you want to select which amenities do, does your space have to offer. For example, if it's a retail space, you, we want to, you want to ensure that the space is a white box minimum, ideally on the, sh on the street level, with the stock room, ground floor, uh, with electricity as well. Once you have done this, select next. Great, now we've finished step one, on to step two. Here you are required to upload photos of your space. Before taking any photos of your space, please ensure that the space is clean, tidy, and in a ready to use condition. Please take at least one photo of the exterior and the rest of the photos can be pictures of the interior as well as the floor plan. If you need any help in terms of guidelines, please look on the right hand side Alternatively, you could download the guide on the storefront platform. Once you have uploaded the pictures, you can select next. Here, you're, here you are required to give a name to your listing. The, here you want to include the use of the space um, as well as a location or a street maybe. Here you need to add a description of your space. We recommend a good description is broken down into three parts. The first part is a two line summary of the location and how it looks. The second part is an in-depth detail of the space and how it's configured. And the third part is how the space integrates into the environment and its neighborhood. Here we recommend you, put, you might wanna add nearby brands and tenants as well as any landmarks. Once you have uploaded your description, select next. Great, now you have completed step two, on to step three. Here you want to select the type of space, the type of project your space is best suited for. For a retail space, it could be available for a pop-up store, but it could also be available for a fashion show, a private sale, or a product launch, add a product launch. Once you have done that, scroll down and select next. Here you need to indicate the minimum duration your space is available for, as well as the maximum duration. You can filter through the number of days, weeks and months. For a retail space, we recommend you have a minimum duration of 30 days. However, if it's an event space, we recommend you have a minimum duration of one day. Once you have done so, once you have done this, please click select next. Once you have selected your minimum duration, you need to include a price. The price needs to be all inclusive of rent, rates and bills. For this example, we will add £5,000. As a reminder, Storefront waives their fees to the landlord. Our fees are paid by the ingoing brand. In this example, the brand will pay £6,000, the landlord will receive £5,000 and we will receive £1,000. If you're unsure as to why that is or you, you forget, hover over the little question mark icon here and it will tell you as to why we've added 20% fees on top. If you're unsure on what to set your price at, please inquire on the storefront help channel um, to speak to one of our local experts and we'll be more than happy to help. Once you have entered your price, select next. Once you have completed all three steps, you need to submit your listing for a review. 
A member of the storefront team will review your space and get in touch with you within 72 hours.